Hi everyone and welcome to Precious Memory Boxes Junk Journaling. And today I have a small um, Amazon haul and scrapbooking with me haul. And uh, we just wanted to show you a few things I picked up. Plus I was sent a couple things from a sponsor. So I wanted to show those to you. So let's get into it and let me show the uh, scrapbooking with me item I picked up first. This is... 49 and Markets. Um, let's see, I've got the name covered up by the pieces here. Let me grab some of them out so I can read it easier. It is called Nature Study Film Strip Frames. So, all kinds of film strip frames in here. Really neat. I don't have the die, you know, to make this, so I thought, well, this would be the next best thing and there's all kinds of little goodies in here so we'll just take them out and look at them real quick all right so you have some looks like negatives and these just have some spots and that on them then we have some open reels so looks like there's one two there's a dark brown a light brown and I think a blue light blue color here there we go there's another so I think there's three colors and then you get two of each if I remember right so we'll grab those out of there here's a negative and the darker brown and the light brown here is uh, another film strip and if you break these apart you've got some little windows and frames so there's that one this one has come apart had a little ant on me <laughs> all right that one's come apart this one has six little windows in it so it's like a double pane and what's neat about that is you can leave those in there if you want or you can plop them pop poke poke them out and use them in other items. Here's a large dark one and here's a large one here that's got the six frame inside of it. So this one was inside of here. And then we've got that. Let's see, I'm not seeing a blue one here. It's a blue one that size. So there's one of each of those. Then you've got the large film strips, one in dark, and the light brown, and then the blue, and then you've got the full frames here, and there should be a dark brown one, I'm not seeing it, but I may have, I opened this briefly the other day, and I may have accidentally dropped it out, oh, there it is. So there's the large ones of those and then we've got these here's the blue there it is that's what I was looking for and the film strip and here's a couple more of these there's multiples of those that's good and then we've got this size which I said you could use as a window or just whatever you want to use it for. One of those in each color and a couple extra frames that have come out of these here. So pretty neat. I can't wait to find a neat way to use those. And I got those from scrapbooking, scrapbookingwithme.com. That is also, um, if you follow on YouTube, that is um, Scrapbooking With Me on YouTube and Melina Pilot on YouTube. They are the owners of the shop. There's the back so you can see it. 49 in Market, Nature Study Film Strip Frame. So pretty neat. Okay, so on uh, Amazon, I picked up these mini paper clips and different metal tones here. Let's see. There's an ant and he just doesn't want to go. All right. 
see if I can open these. I'm still fighting that ant. <laughs> he is determined. He wants to be part of the video. Okay. Almost got it open. There we go. I think, I think we just about got it. Trying not to spill them all, but I think I am. There we go. Oh, I opened them upside down. That was smart. <laughs> okay, so we've got the antique finish, kind of like the Tim Holtz ones, if you've seen those. So we'll grab some of them out, put them there. We have the gold finish, which I really like. But these come in handy for clipping things in your journal, and they're fun. We have a copper finish. I like those. And then this is like a brown. Kind of, um, this is more of an antique brass, and this is more of like an antique copper. So I like those. And we've got a silver. And then we've got like a, can't quite tell what those are. Maybe like a, tarnished silver. They're not really black, but maybe a tarnished silver. So those are pretty neat and you get 300 pieces in there. So not too bad. If I can, I'll try to link those below. And then I picked up, this is a large vintage specimen card, big size. So if you like to make specimen cards, that's what this die is for. And it has, I think, three pieces here. So you have the the uh, cutout for the window and that. And then you have the cutout for the plate. I really like that. That's neat. So large specimen die. That's a lot. That's bigger than I thought it was going to be, but I like it. Okay, and then my other items I have to share with you from Amazon. This is from... Um, bleeds it's B L E D S they have a shop on Amazon and she contacted me and asked me if I'd be interested in reviewing some of their products so this box right here she sent me and um, it has lots of little papers in it and different packages sorry for the crinkling so we have cottage garden they all say cottage garden, but they're different pictures. We'll open one pack here and look at them in a minute. So they just have different colors and tones in them. Let's open this one and look at it. What these are good for is on with clusters, I think. You know, to help you build the clusters. So lots of good little pieces. So you probably have two of each in here. And really they are perfect size for clusters. I like those. The uh, postal. Those are good. I don't know where home is, but I'm on my way. Oh neat. It's a lot of letter types. Save the day. <laughs> So, neat, and then we've got this size that is, says postcard. Then we have a cream color, a green. You're getting too caught up in things that don't matter. <laughs> Some type of little sentiment written on there. Here's postcard, airmail. So each little package, I guess, has like a little seam. This one is postal. And then we've got beautiful little picture of a little girl. Oh, these are cute. So three different size papers in each package. And I think it's about 60 pieces in each one. So like I said, these make, these would be great for clusters or 
Um, if you're trying to build a focal point or layering or snippet rolls, these would be perfect for snippet rolls. So those are really nice. I like them because they're thin because, um, you know, that way you can build layers with them and it won't get too thick. So, and like I said, each package there has a different theme. So this was like a postal theme in this one. And let's see, I'll put this one back away. And so in this, this is a whole little kit together. So in this one, you get one, two, this one's like ledger pages, I like that. Three, that one is like neutrals. This is uh, blues and greens. Each one has 60 pieces in it. There's a kind of different colors. And then I love the patterns on this one. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six. So 360 little sheets of paper there that you can use for different things. You get a tape roller, which is nice. Glue tape roller. You also get some beautiful little flowers. And let's see, we'll, we'll open these. Let me cut them here with my scissors so you can see them. And let me move this over here a little bit so you can see it. So these are stickers, I do believe. And it says you get 40 pieces. Maybe not stickers. Let me look on the back here. Um, it says sticker pack, so these must be like washi stickers then. So looks like you may get a couple of each. Mostly yellow flowers. They're really pretty. You can use those definitely on tags and cards, journaling cards. Um, you know, you can use them on anything. Use them on focal points. It's a really pretty big sunflowers there. Some tulips. Uh, irises or lilies. That's a carnation. Some type of daisy. And I don't know all my flowers, so, but those are pretty. All in yellow. So I really, I like those. Those are pretty. So you get 40 of those in this pack. All comes in a little box there. Little boxes come in handy so you don't lose things. All right, trying to get a hold of them. Cut most of my fingernails off, so. All right, two more there. Okay, now we got all those. The next thing in the kit is this large packet of note collection series. So there are 100 pieces in here. So this one has different shape pieces and you could even use the backer on this one for a tag or a label. But basically you have, there's some labels in here and again, some more paper that you could use for layering or clusters. Um, you could back them on cardstock and make them a little more sturdy and use them for small journaling cards. Well, that's like a calendar. I don't know if you can see that. That's neat. Here's some labels. Those are pretty. More labels. There's some note cards. Here's uh, more labels. That just looks like some tea stain dyed paper. 
large daisy and looks like a wax seal. There's a square, it says September, which is perfect since this is the month of September. And there's like a ledger page, some florals. Looks like notepad paper there, tags, little label. There we go. So there's lots and lots of different goodies in here that you could use for everything. So just lots of little bits and pieces. So that's wonderful. So, oh, mushrooms. I love mushrooms. So lots of different fun stuff you could use there. And this kit, which included everything I just showed you, so you have 100 pieces here, and then you have 360 pieces of the other paper in the different varieties. Okay. All of these, and then you have the stickers, 40 pieces, and a tape runner. And it comes in this nice little gift box, so if you wanted to gift that to someone, you definitely could do that. And you get um, all of this, I believe, for $13.99, so not too bad. So I'm going to put this back in here. And then I'm going to, I ordered one item from the shop, uh, myself, from the Bleeds shop. Hope, oh, oh, I'm saying that right. And I ordered a multi-pack of the flowers. So we're not going to open them all, but I ordered the yellows, which I believe is the same pack I got. And then I got the purples. And each of these have 40 flowers in them. I got the tulips in multiple colors. And then I got some tall flowers in here. So I got, um, let's see if they have a name. Just says florals and poems. And you get, let's see how many large pieces you get in here. The smaller packages, you get 40. And I'm not seeing how many are in this one, so we'll take them out and see. But the larger ones, you get one, two, three, four, five, six. So you get six large stem ones in each of these. I think all together, if I remember right, you're getting like 160 flowers in this. And if I remember right, this was, let me look here. I can look real quick and see what the cost of this one was. Hold on just a second. I'll look at my order here on Amazon and okay, let's see. It's a hundred and forty one stickers and it costs eight ninety nine. So not too bad for as much as you're getting. These make these are great on tags or a tall journal and um, focal point and the small ones you can use anywhere tags snippets clusters um, you know on your pages so I've been wanting those for a while so I picked those up too so go and check out her shop it's um, when you go to Amazon just type in B L E D S shop and I'll put a link down below to uh, this kit right here 
um, but you can go check out their shop on Amazon and uh, see what there is that you like there. And I hope you enjoyed my mini haul. And uh, next video, we will be working on the bee journal. We're going to start putting the um, signatures together. So I hope you'll come back and join me. And uh, I hope you have a good evening and a wonderful day. And we'll see you next time. Thank you.